All right, this video, we're going to take a look at how to upload an assignment. So you're in a course and you have an assignment due. Uh, you scroll to that particular item. And in this case, we have ours right here. We know it's an assignment because it's called assignment. We select it. And when we get in here, we'll have some uh, explanation of what we need to do. In this case, we're going to download an attached file, open it, and change the document file name, and then submit it into this activity. So typically, I would click on that. I would download it. Once I download it, um, I would open it up, and it tells me, it gives me these same directions. And the key here is that I want to change the name of this file. I don't want to just download or upload the same file that I downloaded. I want to make sure that uh, there's an understanding that it's my file. So I'll go to File menu, I'll go to Save As, and then it's going to ask me right here, what's the name I'm going to give it? Well, in this case, I'm going to give it a different name. I'm going to give it, uh, I'm going to do my first and last name, and I'm just going to call it assignment two or whatever the assignment is that um, I so choose, that, that it is within the course. I'm going to hit save. Now that saved it to where it went. So in this case, it went to my download folder. So I want to keep that in mind for this next step. All right, this is saved. I'm ready to submit it come down here and I go to in notice down here gives me some information about what's going on here uh, right now I'm, I'm about to make my first attempt I haven't submitted anything yet nothing's been graded um, and there are no comments so all right that's all good to know let me add submission it brings me to this page again I have the same instructions and now at this point I can do one of two things I can click in this area and it will bring up um, this area here where I can up, select upload a file on the left and then browse for that file and upload it. I can also drag and drop. So if I have my desktop readily available, I'm going to drag and drop that file. There we go. Notice that it is named in the way that I named it. So I know it's the new file. Otherwise, for this submission, that's all I have to do. I select Save Changes and now it's been submitted. And I know that it's been submitted because when I come down to submission status, I will see my first attempt. It's been submitted for grading, hasn't been graded yet. Here's when I submitted it and here's the document itself. So all of that is great. If I need to actually change something or add a new submission, I can go to edit submission. If I have submitted the wrong assignment, I can come here and remove submission. So that's a submission assignment feature. Um, it's really useful in all your classes and you will inevitably end up needing to um, use it at some point in your time here. So hope this is helpful. Let me know if you have any questions.